for open channel flow measurements. Weirs are well adapted to irrigation canals and natural stream. A primary advantage is the theoretical predictability of their hydraulic performance. Thin, sharp edge, plate or rectangular notch weirs may be used. In absence of sidewall contraction, the flow above a sharp crested weir is basically two-dimensional and the flow field may be solved by analytical and graphical method, the ideal fluid flow theory. The following sketch illustrates a graphical solution of a flow net analysis. For a ventilated nap, the discharge per unit width may be expressed as a function of the relative upstream water depth, in which C is a dimensionless discharge coefficient. The dimensionless discharge coefficient is a function of a relative upstream height, and a correlation is shown. For an infinitely high sharp crested weir, it yields C equals 0 0.61 which correspond to an ideal fluid flow result for an orifice flow, developed by von Mises in 1917. Sharp crested weirs are very accurate discharge meters. They are typically used for small or relatively small flow rates. For a vertical sharp crested weir, the lower nap is deflected upwards immediately downstream of the sharp edge on the maximum elevation of the lower nap on its location can be predicted. Nap aeration is extremely important. If the nap is not properly ventilated, the discharge characteristics of the weir are substantially affected and the weir may not operate safely. Sometimes the crest can be contracted at the sidewall to facilitate nap ventilation. 